Hello and welcome back to a new video on this channel. The video today is about Sketch Focus, a new plugin for Sketch. Now, this plugin says it will boost our productivity by keeping us on task. Now, we can download it or upgrade to Pro All on SketchFocus.com. And what it does is that if you are in Sketch and you have such a nice user interface uh, or UI kit right here, then you can open it up after you installed it. Just click the file to double click the file to install it. And you get this small little window right here. Now let me like put this next to each other like that. We get this nice little window right here, which says Sketch Focus or in my case Sketch Focus Pro and we can add notes or tasks. Now what you can do is you can select one of your items like for example this button and I can say I want to add a note like uh, should this button be green like that. Now we got a note and we can of course also say we want to add a task just click this little icon and you get over to the task area where you can say make the font bold like that and you can uh, delete these tasks or notes you can add them to your favorites which makes them bold and what you basically get is an amazing overview of the things of the tasks or notes that you created. Now let me add some more so we can uh, get a better impression of what it really does. Uh, let's say um, make it bigger. Let's add a new note to this screen right here. Could be red or something like that. You can add anything you want and I just want to show you what the app does. Like as I said, you get this overview, these details, you can add some more stuff like right in here and you can add more linked layers. If you click this right here, you get directly to the item itself, to the layer. You can uh, click this little icon right here to get to the right artboard and you can click here to get to the whole page. You can add linked layers, like in this case we could say the text of the menu should be a linked layer, then you simply select the layer and click linked selected layers, like that. And right now you can really easily jump between these two layers, just like that. So you saw that we also have like some tasks right here and we can do the, exactly the same. Just clicking these uh, icons and areas will get us to the exact position. We can also of course add details here, add link layers right there and we can say these are completed. You can search for tasks like could be red or for example like green, you can filter them with several options right here and you can sort them in any way that you want. The great thing about this little window is that you can also just customize it. You can export your data, all the stuff that you created right here. Uh, you can import data and you can delete all. Now that's great because if you have like 50 entries about notes and so on, you don't want to delete them like, like this, which will take much time. You can delete them all once right here. You can define the user interface color. Like in this case, I like the bluish one, but you can choose any color you like. You can also say, I want to have a dark mode and that's also quite nice. If I add a note right here, you see that all this stuff right here is way better visible. You get a better impression of all the stuff. And 
it's just easier for you to just see what you created. You see some stuff right here about the license and you see about sketch focus, some details. You can tweet it and you can share the stuff to get a 25% discount because the pro version costs $9.99 and I can only recommend you to support the creators which created this really awesome plugin. Uh, if you have complex UI kits like this one, I don't even have to zoom out, I can simply click right here to get a full overview of all the screens. Um, if you have a huge UI kit like this one, then you want to add notes and to add tasks and you can attach them to any item that you have in this little box. And I think that's really a great feature, that's really a great advantage that we have right now because um, I didn't really see something like this before and they made a great job and yeah. So go to sketchfocus.com as I said, look at the website and they have already gained quite some attraction right here. I can only recommend you trying the plugin out and yeah, so if you like this little tutorial then just uh, click the thumb up button or subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Now thank you for your time and enjoy your week. See you!